What you've just seen is just a small piece of what we do at the Wakefield Police Department. Today I'm here with Officer Kelly Tobine. Kelly, can you tell me what your most rewarding experience has been with the Wakefield Police Department? One New Year's Eve, I delivered a baby. Um, we got a call at 12.43, and I think the baby was in my arms at 12.47. That is kind of exciting. And how, was the, how were the parents towards you? Were they very thankful and excited? I think they were more shocked. More shocked? As shocked as you were to <laughs> deliver <Yes>. a baby? <laughs> Yes. That's, that sounds great. And you're also a member of the, uh, the, the department's Honor Guard. Have you, have you had any opportunities to do any exciting things as part of the Honor Guard? I have. We get to honor the people who have passed, but also um, we've had the experience of going to Fenway and being the Honor Guard for one of the Red Sox games. And that had to be kind of exciting to, to be in front of 30,000 people. It was nerve-wracking, but it was exciting. What do you think the most rewarding experience has been for you? For me, I, I don't want to talk about one individual experience. I, I think every day when I go to work, um, the, every day is rewarding. Every day there's an opportunity to help somebody with a problem that they have. Maybe they don't know the answer. Um, somebody's having a bad day. I can help them with their bad day. If I can go home at the end of my shift and know that I helped somebody make their day better, that's rewarding for me. And I, I think that's what I love about this job the most, is that I have the, the opportunity to have an impact on people's lives. And, a positive impact and help them improve their lives and, and have a better day. Kelly, if you can share with me some of your most rewarding experiences you've had since you've been with the Wakefield Police Department. Um, I'll start off when I was working patrol. You can do everything from being a car seat installer to being on the honor guard and going to Fenway um, to answering calls for service as it's like delivering babies. And then you kind of find your niche and um, now I'm in the schools. And I can be a bridge between uh, the police department and the school department and really try and brighten up someone's day. And what kind of impact do you think you've had with the students as a school resource officer? Pretty big one. Um, around town, they're yelling out of their cars and they're coming down the hallway. They know your name and they always laugh and say hi to you. Lieutenant, out of your 21 years of the experience as being a police officer, what's the most memorable experience? Well, I've had the opportunity to do a lot of different things in 21 years. I think what's most memorable for me is uh, representing the Wakefield Police Department with the Northeastern Massachusetts Law Enforcement Council or NEMLEC in Boston after the, the, uh, the marathon bombings in 2013. Um, obviously that was a, a trying time for everybody and um, just the impact it had on the city and the country and the opportunity to go in and help and, and be a part of uh, helping catch those two individuals. The Wakefield Police Department is looking for qualified men and women. If law enforcement is a career that interests you, please sign up for the Civil Service Police Officer Exam. It's being given on April 25th. There's a sign-up deadline of March 13th. You can fill out your application at mass.gov. Just click on the Human Resources tab.